Public Administration Minister and Senior Awami League Leader Said Ashraf Islam is undergoing treatment in Bangkok with serious ailment. Today his younger brother Major Jen, Red, Said Shafa Chal Islam said, he is suffering from fourth stage cancer. He even cannot recognize anyone. He also criticized a group of people who are engaged in making untrue remarks over the illness and said the vested quarter is spreading lies saying that a sharful Islam would return in politics soon. Shafa Chal said, Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina is well aware about Ashraful's illness and is maintaining communication to know his developments. On 17th of September, the parliament approved 90 days leave for ailing Ashraf Islam, also former general secretary of the ruling Awami League. The speaker moved it to parliament and read out the application and the House granted the leave by voice vote. According to the application, Said Ashraf, elected from Kishorganj 1 constituency, is now undergoing treatment at the Critical Care Medicine Unit of Bumarang Grad Hospital in Bangkok. Syed Ashraf Islam was born in 1952. He is a Bangladeshi politician of the Awami League. He is a member of Parliament and Minister of Public Administration of the Government of Bangladesh. Islam served for a time as Minister of Local Government and Rural Development. He was a Mukti Bahini member during the Bangladesh Liberation War of 1971. He was involved in politics from the student life. He became the General Secretary of Greater Mimensing District Khatra League and Assistant Publicity Secretary of the Central Unit. He also worked as the Acting General Secretary of Awami League after the arrest of its General Secretary, Abdul Jalil. Now he is working as the spokesman of Bangladesh Awami League Party. He is the eldest son of Said Nasrul Islam, acting president of the Mujibnagar government in 1971. He served as General Secretary of the Awami League. In 1975, following the killing of Islam's father in prison along with three other national leaders, he immigrated to the United Kingdom and lived in London borough of Tower Hamlets. Whilst living in Tower Hamlets, he was involved in Bangladeshi community activism and played an important role in formation of Bangladesh Youth League BYL. He was elected as an Education Secretary of Federation of Bangladeshi Youth Organization FBYO, and worked at an education project based at Montefiore Centre in Tower Hamlets. Before immigrating to the United Kingdom, he completed Higher Secondary Certificate, HSC, in 1973 from Mimensing Zilla School. He returned to Bangladesh in 1996 and was elected Member of Parliament, MP, from his home constituency, Kishorganj Sadar in the seventh national elections of Bangladesh. He was elected an MP in the 2001 election as well. He worked as a member of the Parliamentary Standing Committee on Foreign Ministry. His electoral pledges include building up developed road and rail link from Dhaka to his hometown, Kishorganj. He is part of a committee to study the judicial pay scale. Islam is known for his attacks on Nobel laureate and Grameen Bank founder Muhammad Yunus. In 2012, while was addressing a program for farmers of cooperatives, he verbally attacked Nobel laureate and Grameen Bank founder. His, Yunus's, basic subject is economics and he introduced microcredit program, but did not get Nobel Prize in economics, he, Yunus got Nobel Prize for Peace. But which war has he stopped with his activities and in which continent has he established peace through his microcredit program? These days many of us know how one gets Nobel Prize. There are some countries in the world and a person's popularity increases once one has chips, cheese sandwiches and white wine in those countries. Islam has also criticized American diplomats. In the same gathering where he criticized Muhammad Yunus, 
he criticized Secretary of State Hillary Clinton for a TV program on ATN Bangla, alleging that she and the moderator, Muni Saha, were attempting to undermine Bangladesh. In 2014, in a meeting in Kolna, Islam called the U.S. Assistant Secretary for South and Central Asian Affairs Nishide Saibiswal, who was on an official visit to Bangladesh, a minister of two pennies, and added that said she cannot change the power in Bangladesh. On the same occasion, he belittled the U.S. Ambassador to Bangladesh, Dan Mazina, calling him Maid Martsina. The news taken from the Daily Star and about his life from Wikipedia. Thanks for watching.